CBS The Young and the Restless that Jesse Gaines always considered Ashland to be his gold mine. He provided for Jesse's life to be happier than before. Jones's character is a lawyer and is also controversial when he repeatedly pressuring and blackmailing Ashland. This is a step forward for her, the writers. He wants to strengthen and develop the plot to keep the fans excited. Ashlyn's plot is quite boring, and now it's time to finish, solve everything. Ashlyn is always gentle with Jesse, no matter how he blackmails him. And why is that? Was Ashlyn afraid of him? In addition, Victoria Newman could learn the truth at any time, which could mean the collapse of the wedding and union. Billy is proving to everyone that his thoughts about Ashlyn are right. He has protected Victoria in his own way, and he doesn't need anyone's approval. Billy Abbott has been branded as a troublemaker and a liar, and he's so used to feeling humiliated and difficult, but viewers know he's been proven right based on Jesse's request, and Ashlyn has verbally accepted it. Victoria still doesn't believe what Billy says, or if she does, she thinks it's just unimportant things she can forgive. Billy's so angry at Victoria, whether she's really stupid or is she pretending. And she can't believe after so many complications, she still loves Ashland. However, Mustache still thinks Nick Newman is staying in touch with Billy's ex. And in case he discovers something unusual, Jesse's taking advantage of Billy's stupidity to sell him important secrets. Jesse understands that he's the person he's most interested in now. Everyone in Genoa longs to know about the past. So the real issue is no longer whether Billy is promoting the theory, but what happens if Jesse doesn't get his money. There is some information that Ashlyn is Jesse's brother, and he gets the money every year because Ashlyn is the heir to the entire property and does not allow Jesse to work in the family corporation. And that's why he and I have to pay the brother an amount every year as a share of the profits. If they were siblings, then just looking at their feelings, they weren't really close. They saw each other as enemies. And every time Ashlyn's younger brother appeared, he got angry and worried. Bobby DeFranco is Ashlyn's real name, and he has to keep this secret for over 30 years. And no one knows about it, but now half the city of Genoa knows. Ashlyn has admitted to Victoria and Nick, but he says it doesn't matter. He loves Victoria, and let's put the past aside. He invented it, but wasn't honest with Victoria or anyone else in Genoa City about why the choice was necessary. Jesse is worried when he learns his brother has terminal cancer and he immediately demands $3 million for the next 10 years, or he will be betrayed. The texts are followed by a face-to-face meeting, which is required. Would Bobby be willing to allow Jesse to take the shots, taking into account the brevity of his life?